This is the ACC Digital Network presented by Ruby Tuesday, our wrap-up from Winston-Salem as Florida State comes to Wake Forest and wins it 67-60. to Bob Rathman and Dan Bonner, it was a blowout early, but in Wake Forest's <laughs> favor, a 24-8 lead. 12 minutes into that first half, Dan had looked for all the world like the Demon Deacons were rolling, but then Florida State righted the ship. Bob, Florida State righted the ship by attacking on defense and by attacking on offense. They started, they stopped settling for the three-point shots. They started getting the ball inside. Ian Miller came off the bench, and he had a fabulous game. Aaron Thomas, even though he didn't shoot the ball well, played very well defensively, rebounded the ball very well, and eventually got his offense going. Those two guys scored 44 of the 67 Florida State points. An outstanding performances by both of them. Let's take a look at the highlights from this one, and we begin with Ian Miller, who was great in transition, spot-up jump shots, three-point range. He did it all. Bob, and he played, even though he came off the bench, he played 31 minutes, made 8 of 12 overall, 5 of 7 from beyond the three-point arc, the only Florida State player to make a three. And he was just, he was a huge offensive factor. And that's his role for this team. He comes in to score. And Aaron Thomas, even though he didn't have his best shooting night, only seven for 17, missed all four of his three-point attempts. Boy, when he decided to take the ball to the basket and get out in transition, he was very, very tough to stop. He had four steals in the game. He had 19 points. He had 14 rebounds. He had three assists. That's a pretty doggone good game, huh? Very athletic and very active in the passing lanes. He was very good tonight, no doubt about it. Florida State earns a very important win. And after shooting 26% in the first half, Florida State by attacking in the second half shoots 64%. They secure 14 offensive rebounds. They get seven steals, just an outstanding game, and they play very, very well on the interior. A dominant performance in the second half by the Seminoles. A big win for the Florida State Seminoles as they knock off the Wake Forest team and Deacons. Aaron Thomas is joining us down on the floor. Aaron, congratulations. It didn't look good early, but you guys really came roaring back in this one. Yeah, um, first half, we put ourselves in a hole. Um, second half, we came out, played much more harder with more energy, and we was able to execute, and, you know, that was it. <laughs> Aaron, let me ask you, it looked like early in the game you guys were taking an awful lot of threes, particularly early in the shot clock. And then when you started to attack the basket, you turned things around a little bit. Is that something you talked about in the huddles there? Uh, yeah, uh, halftime, coach told us we're taking too many jumpers. Let's get the ball inside, you know, attack the uh, basket. I think we did a good job of that in the second half. Um, our bigs did a good job of rolling. Uh, Strong to the hole, we was able to find our big. And, um, you know, Boards did a good job of finishing. And, you know, when those guys was paying attention and locked the boards, uh, the lane started to open up for the guards. We'll have to call you a big now. 14 <laughs> rebounds tonight. <laughs> Congratulations. Florida State wins 67 to 60. They improved to 6 and 7 in the ACC. This is the ACC Digital Network presented by Ruby Tuesday. <laughs>